Okay, so the other day I found this really cool GitHub repo. It's aptly named Resources for Linux on Checkmatable iDevices. Now that's kind of an esoteric mouthful, I know, but in layman's terms, it means that this repository is full of resources for running Linux on older Apple devices using a hardware exploit, the exact same one that a lot of jailbreaks use. Pretty much anything older than the iPhone X and iPad 7th generation is covered by this repository. Now, I find this repository particularly interesting because Apple are infamous for dropping support for old hardware, despite how powerful their devices usually are. Imagine how cool it would be if you could just install Linux on older Apple devices instead of throwing them out. It should be said, though, that this project is super early in development, so don't get too excited just yet. As it stands at the moment, this project will allow you to boot Linux on your Apple device, but it's basically useless for end users because almost nothing within Linux works yet. So you might be asking, what exactly can you do with this project at the moment? Well, using a fairly long and technical process, you can boot a Linux kernel. That's really about it. This is very much a developer's toy at the moment and isn't going to be useful to end users for quite some time. However, I don't say any of that to make this project seem at all unimpressive. Doing anything like this with an Apple device is really no small feat at all, and I really am excited for the future of projects like this. If we can run Linux on Apple Silicon, then surely we can do it on iDevices too. I know that I would love to run Linux on my iPad, but with that said though, that's it for today's video. I thank you for watching it, and I will see you in the next one.